Let's come together in this spirit of unconditional love. That which has created us out of itself knows us as itself, knows us as an expression of itself. It has no sense of self and other. It is one with us and we are one with it in truth, in essence. We are of its nature. We are in its image and likeness. This experience of unity, this experience of oneness, is perfect love. It does not depend upon any conditions. It does not require being loved back. It does not require a formal role, a formal relationship. It is not a responsibility. It simply is perfect unity. That divine love has created us out of itself and left us alone to make this magnificent discovery. Because in being alone to make the discovery, we express life uniquely. We develop a unique, individualized expression of that one. As each wave on the ocean is some part of the ocean, but a unique part of the ocean, we too are some part of the unity which is God. Today we accept our responsibility to awaken to the truth that there is in reality no separation we step out of the cave we crack open the shell in which we have been incubating We let go of all ideas of right doing and wrong doing that have separated us from ourselves, from our God, from each other. And we accept unconditional love. We recognize that on this planet, on this plane of existence, this thing called motherhood, these people called mothers, are a perfect illustration of God's unconditional love for us. So today we celebrate mothers everywhere, we celebrate motherhood and we celebrate the unconditional love motherhood represents. <clears throat> we are grateful for this opportunity to be together today to share these ideas and we are grateful for this life we have in which to practice the experience of unconditional love love. The more deeply, the more truly we love, 
the more we experience God. We release this treatment to that perfect law that knows exactly what to do, when to do it, and how to do it, and is right now creating a greater opening in our consciousness and in all consciousness through which God's unconditional love flows into and through us. Today the world is a little lighter, a little brighter, as more love passes into it by means of us. We release this treatment knowing so certain it is done that we say together, and so it is.